The most commonly used balance in biotech laboratories is called an analytical balance. An analytical balance allows us to take very precise measurements up to four places to the right of the decimal point. Sliding glass doors prevent air currents from affecting the measurements. The tear button zeroes out the balance. In today's experiment, we will be checking the linearity of the balance by testing its response at its midpoint. Linearity error occurs when a balance is properly calibrated at the bottom and top of its range, but its weight values in the middle are not correct. If a balance has a linearity error beyond the manufacturer's specifications, then it must be professionally repaired. Let's test our balance. We'll be weighing four items, a rubber stopper, a metal bar, a wood block, and a cork. Let's label them A, B, C, and D. First, place the weigh boat onto the balance pan and close the glass doors. Press the tear button to zero out the weigh boat. Next, weigh all four pieces together. Close the glass doors. The combined mass of all four objects is 99.4373 grams. This is called the full scale value. Record this value in your lab notebook. Now remove the items, leaving the weigh boat in the balance. Tear the balance again if necessary. Next, weigh items A and B together. The combined mass of items A and B is 83.9690 grams. Record this value in your lab notebook. Weigh items C and D together. The combined mass is 15.4676 grams. Record the value in your lab notebook. Now add the two values together to get 99.4366 grams. This total is called the weight sum. If the balance is exactly linear at its midpoint, then the weight sum will equal the full scale value. On our balance, the two values are not equal. Let's take the difference. 99.4373 grams minus 99.4366 grams gives us 0 0.0007 grams. Because we took two measurements, let's divide by two which gives us 0.0004 grams. Now we have successfully identified the linearity error at the balance's midpoint.